De La Wright, my envies. Welcome. Ikpi's uncle allegedly, reportedly, uh, um, um, as it is rumored, as it is not be Mito Hamley, you know, um, escorted out of the palace as they came to probe on the issue of um, um, what is plaguing their daughter. Now, we have had a report that is making the rounds on social media that um, um, Ikpi is going through so, um, um, some plague that has to do with itchiness in her body. And this happens only when she is in the palace. As a matter of fact, they said that uh, she entered the palace um, today um, um, and as she was entering the palace, she was fine. Immediately, she got into the palace to sit down. The thing started, and she, like, um, uh, maintained, she greeted, went with Oni of Ife um, to thank people and see people. She was smiling and all of that. Immediately, wow, she entered the vehicle and she left the palace. Now, when she left the palace, they said that um, one of the biggest um, confusion she had was that... Um, when Oni Ovife had invited her earlier, like Oni was the one who invited her into the palace, that when Oni invited her in, um, earlier in the palace, that she um, spent up to four hours in the palace, nothing happened to her. Like nothing happened to her. She didn't go through those experiences. She didn't have um, and the itching and everything. She was peaceful in the palace. But um, uh, and she stayed there. When it was time for her to leave, she didn't leave. That thing started coming after her again. Then when she brought herself to the palace today, as we are hearing, without the invitation of the Oni, they said immediately she entered the palace. That stuff started happening again. And um, uh, it was it was it was terrible. So um they said why why their, their concern is that um why is it that if she's not invited into the palace, that plague comes. Um, against her and when she is invited into the palace she can stay peacefully so they said she got into the palace immediately she stepped into the palace that thing started happening to her she had to hold herself to go and greet greet people she saw the people she needed to see and she ran out of the palace again because of that and why the family is being suspicious is the fact that KBAC is not trying to get any solution there are a lot of Ifa priests inside the palace nobody is doing anything KBAC is not showing any concern you know they said the money He's not even showing any concern. The man is acting as though he does not know what is plaguing the wife. And that is the concern, a concern for, you know, um, um, the family of the wife. And that is why they came in their number to find out what is going on and why the husband to the woman who is supposed to care for this woman and love the woman and show the woman all the love in the world would not care if this is something that is um, likely to really hurt the woman. Now, they said when they came, um, um, uh, the palace guards were all over the place. Usually, they would not say anything that right now, KBSC has stopped saying stay in the palace, don't stay in, this, in, in the palace, because it does seem as if he found a solution for all of these women. Right now, I will bring you a story about um, Auntie Blue Blue. I think, I mean, Auntie... Um, uh, Ebony, maybe they have given her her own time limit to live. She does not live. This kind of a thing can be happening to her. Now, people like Dr. Elizabeth, they say they are going and coming and everything is fine. They don't have a problem. Even gospel, they say she doesn't even have a problem. So as we are here, you know, they said that was why they came to find out what is going on and why KBSC is not saying a word about what is going on. Now, how can KBSC say a word about what is going on? If it is true, everything we are hearing that this same woman is saying she wants half of your wealth and the woman needs your help and the woman is the one who brought herself, brought this upon herself. Um, who would want to be a part of this? Like, who would want to care whether something is happening to you or not? The thing is that when you show a man that you are a man, you have become a man. A man allows you to take care of yourself. Maybe this is what is happening between her and Kabi AC. Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Della Rama. I bring you fresh and spicy juice from the sauce. It's still on the Royals. How are you guys doing? I appreciate you. I love you. I thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, my people. Thank you. If you're yet to subscribe, kindly go ahead. Hit that subscribe button and do not forget to turn on the notification bell. And do not forget to give this video a thumbs up. I appreciate each and every one of you. 
Dela right, my Dela right, my Dela right, my super people. Dela right, my Dela right, my Dela right, my own people. I hope you guys are doing very well. I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you so much. We've gotten a report oh, that they have, you know, pushed um, uh, and um, family out of the palace because they keep coming and going in their numbers, asking the same question. The same question that we had allegedly as it is rumored that they are supposed to ask their daughter. What is it you have done? Why is this coming upon you? Who do we need to meet and who do we meet, need to beg? But they keep focusing on KBLC because they thought it's business as usual. Usually KBLC will go all out to try and find out what the problem is and try and see what he can do. But right now they said... The man is not even taking the pain to do all of this because he has time and time warned them again that what you are sowing, you're going to reap. You have to disease from some of these things you are doing. Understand that you are in a traditional community. The gods might not be saying anything right now. That does not mean that they do not know what you are doing or they are not saying what you are doing. That when the dance happens, I hope you guys will be willing to dance it. No, they said no, they will not because of course their own is that they want to um, um, uh, displace Naomi. They don't want Naomi to return back. So we have also heard that this um, drama with this Oloris is also a territorial fight um, that is not just about the only of Ife. It's something that has to do with, you know, a lot of other situations, okay? And um, um, so right now, we don't even know what to say about what is going on. Um, they said this um, thing with the plague. A lot of people are saying only knows about it. Meanwhile, they said they have also gone to see Anifa, um, a priest who told them that it has to do with that pot. Um, that um, pot that, you know, um, was uh, removed from the palace that the um, constitution guiding the removal of the pot naturally was not followed and the rituals they were supposed to do was not done and if anything happened and that pot was removed the pot was supposed to be removed and thrown into the river but that was not it because you know the circumstances for which the pot was removed it wasn't like a natural thing it was something that had to um, do with force they had to remove the pot just so that they can you know, um, um, make the palace more uh, comfortable for um, people. So right now they say it is a repercussion that is causing all of this itchy, itchiness that is um, um, plaguing Olori and Ikbi and Olori and um, Blublo. But and they say they have made this thing very clear to the family of Ikbi. But why they keep coming back to KBS is what nobody understands. And they say that is why um, KBSC had to make them to lead them out of the palace peacefully because he said he had absolutely nothing to discuss with them. Uh, they are coming um, and thinking that he knows exactly what is going on with Ikbe and um, 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 he should be able to do something about it. But he has made it clear that he, they said he's not even saying anything, that anybody who um, uh, causes a problem, should be able to deal with it. I'm going to bring you more update. I appreciate you so much. Thank you.